Quick thing about Marketo, we have about 2,300 customers. We've been in business about five years. Our goal is to bring marketing and sales together. Our professional services team, which is broken out in two units. There's our enterprise team, which works on large, big engagements, so they need project management tools. And then we have our SMB group, which is probably about 85% of our consulting. And these are very transactional based engagements and I don't know how else we could do it without Clarison. Really like what we saw in Clarison. We looked at several other vendors. So the big thing for us was um, I was really impressed with the Salesforce integration, that visibility across the organization, the ties with opportunity and accounts. All the other systems I saw was like a one-to-one -one relationship and we have we can have multiple projects from a single opportunity and I need to have the capability to have up to like 10 to 20 projects. I just couldn't have that one-to-one -one relationship as like some of the other platforms. Our end users are not project managers. We saw Clarison as the game changer where it's actually gonna help people do their day-to-day -day work. Because we have so many different project types, because our businesses are so different, we run everything by metrics. So every week I run this using the Excel ad and this is our utilization report. It's an actual vital tool for us. We use it for utilization, resource reporting. And we also use it for revenue reporting and invoicing. We created a project close process that they go through this list of 20 questions when they close out a project and it gives them a maturity score at the end of the day. And um, our customer success use it, team uses that to help gauge adoption. So right now, that was a big hit with our sales team and our, um, our renewals team so they can see how well people are adopting um, different Marketo product, products. So we created this concept of checkpoints and escalations using Clarison. and identify, track, and escalate at-risk customers within 90 days. So that's what it is. So within the first 90 days, identify, show me the ones that are at risk and, and escalate. If one of these SLAs isn't met, Clarison will actually alert the consultant, give them an alert and say, hey, is there an issue, like an alarm clock? And then if they say yes, they can pick different reasons. And if there is a problem, we'll escalate to the right person, we'll put it on a dashboard and have us re reach out. I, I use the Clarison report because it's pretty because I can put icons in it. I, I can put icons in the Salesforce one, but it takes more time. This, this was really easy and they were all like, wow, that's cool. All of our executives look at this dashboard and, and look at it as for the health of the project.